Hey, for both guys, obviously it's a close four-point game at halftime. You guys pulled away to win by your usual margin. What, what was the difference in the second half, do you think, for, for both you guys? Uh, our defense, uh, we kind of locked in and came together. Got multiple stops to start the first half. Uh, like Coach said, I think they were stuck at 38 for a while, and then they got to 42 and got stuck. So our defense really went to another level in the second half. Um, I just think we played with a lot more energy in that second half. Uh, first half, we was kind of slow, but uh, we just picked it up. Darryl, before the season, Jalen told anyone who would listen that he had turned himself into a bona fide three-point shooter. What, what are you seeing out of him and his confidence with shooting tonight? I know he hit a couple uh, threes there late in the game, and but all season, it's, it's been just amazing from behind the arc. Uh, his confidence is sky high right now. Um, he feels like when he's on the floor, he's the best guard on the floor. Um, and nobody can guard him in his head. So that's that's a great way to go out there and, and play the game. With that confidence, he can play at a high level any night. Dustin, in the first half, kind of what was working for you? I think you got 10 points all in that first half. Um, just being active, um, just doing things we do every day in practice. Uh, it just came my way. And I was just being energetic, being active, and just doing multiple things. You guys had nine turnovers, so less than ten. I think like the fifth game in a row. What What do you think was the key to that? Because it was a little sloppy early. You know, I think you guys hadn't played in eight days, so maybe a little rust. What What, what do you think was the key to limiting the turnovers again? Uh, just playing together, sharing the ball, um, not being selfish, just going out there playing the game the way it's supposed to be played. You don't have to worry about anything. The turnovers come when you start forcing. So tonight we just try not to force a lot of things. Uh, really. <laughs> um, uh, do you think the first half, you guys are a little slow? Do you think that was just the layoff or the Christmas break? Or why, why do you think you guys maybe didn't come out? Nothing. Like usually do? Uh, Nothing. It happens. Yeah. Wasn't I mean, the we Christmas got off to break. a good start, I thought. Uh, just kind of slowed down as the half went on. I mean, it's basketball. Teams go on runs. It's just how you can come together and fix it. Two days aren't Christmas. It's not a Christmas break either. Just to let all. you know that, Bob. We've never had a break. At so. All. It's not the break. It's not the food. It's nothing. <laughs> and you guys had, yeah, obviously Tennessee's coming in here. They're ranked. Well, what are your feelings about opening the SEC play against Tennessee on Saturday and a um, big game? It's another great opportunity. It's our biggest game because it's the next game on the schedule. Um, it's going to be a sold out crowd. I saw on social media already. So it's going to be a great experience again. I mean, they might be ranked, but they got to come to Bud Walton. That's all. <laughs> That's about all we got to say. <laughs> all right, thanks, Austin. You almost gave Bob another question. <laughs>